Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. If you guys have a BMW such as 3 Series, 5 Series, X3, X5 or Z3 and Z4 and the car dies when it idles, let's say you approach a, a stop light or a traffic light, something guys, stop sign and the car idles the moment you let off the gas, we'll explain what causes that. Stay with us guys. Uh, we'll demonstrate on this 3 series, but that same engine M54 is being used on uh, uh, 3 series, 5 series, X3, X5, Z3 and Z4. Now, we we'll guys have more than 200 videos on every car we get at the shop because our mission guys is to save you as much money as we can. So please guys, hit that subscribe button, like the video and leave a comment below, let us know what you think and if it was helpful. So, let us show you guys how it dies and how we're going to fix it now. So let us show you now guys uh, how the vehicle uh, dies, I'll start it. And it dies. If I pump the gas, it's going to stay on. And the moment I let go, it dies. So, what we'll do now, okay, you can use the scanner, guys. Okay, this scanner, let me show you now. Uh, let me just start from the beginning so you can see. It's an amazing scanner, guys, and you've seen it, we've used it a lot. It works not just on BMW or pretty much any car. You can read and delete codes from the engine computer, airbag computers, also the ABS computer and the traction control computer. And you can see all the different functions that it has. It's amazing, amazing too. I will definitely recommend guys. So we'll go to the enter the engine computer. These two you can find where we bought ours from in the description of the video of, of the video guys. Please check it out. It's very affordable for what it can do in my opinion. It can pay itself off in just one, one time use. That's what it looks like. Pretty, pretty nice. Uh, you have the memory card here that you can update. Now it's connecting to the vehicle computer and we're going to see what we have. Now, there are three reasons why your BMW may die like that. Three of them, at least, guys. And those are the three most common ones. We will uh, cover all of them now with the scanner we'll be able to detect one of the reasons but the other two make sure you stay until the end because it's something guys that the scanner sometimes cannot detect so we're going to enter the engine computer ah let me go back codes found too we're going to click read codes stored codes right here and what we have now right here guys we need to select bmw because there's there are specific codes for the bmw Two codes and they say idle speed, idle speed control valve opening solenoid and idle speed control valve closing solenoid. So probably guys we have a problem with the idle control valve. We'll explain where it's located but we will explain what two reasons could lead to the car not idling and dying once you let off the gas. So let's go ahead turn it off and we'll show you what we're talking about. So now guys we remove the air filter box out of the way so I can show you that that M54 engine is being used on the 3.5 series X3, X5 and Z3 and Z4 and all of them will be about the same guys, the same components. So uh, the idle control valve and the code that we have for that is hidden right there. Okay, you can see, okay, that shiny thing back here. Okay, that's your idle control motor right there. So you have to remove the intake boot, okay, and the uh, um, throttle body bracket to get to it. It's doable, okay. We, we have it guys on the channel how to replace that. Now, this is in our case. What else could be causing the car to die? Okay, cracks in the intake boot. Okay, check it out, this intake boot started cracking everywhere. Okay, those are cracks. And these cracks, okay, like right here. Check this thing out, the whole thing is cracked guys. And those cracks, the car will start getting more air. Uh, it measures one certain amount of air through the MAF sensor. <coughs> but actually guys, you take more air and with the same amount of fuel, it's going to cause actually the car to die. And as a result guys, okay, those cracks, it can die and may not even start. And on the bottom, okay, the hose is broken all the way. Okay, check it out right here. This hose is completely broken guys, so that could be another reason why we have the code. So, we will have guys video how to replace that as well. So that's reason number two. Reason number three, it could be bad MAF sensor that can do the same thing. Because it cannot measure the right amount of air. So we'll go ahead and replace our hose, we'll replace the idle control motor and see if that fixes the problem in our case. 
so let's go ahead start it and see how it sounds now okay it fired right up guys I'm not hitting the throttle pedal at all still idling let's rev it up everything's good all we need to do clear the light okay the service engine light with the computer it's pretty simple you can check it out on the channel you just go ahead click back okay we need to connect I don't want to waste your time just click erase codes and you're done so thank you guys for watching hopefully that will be helpful for some of you having that problem and see you guys next time